I grew up in Bakersfield, California, and I didn't really fall into books until about fifth grade. My family moved across town, and I began riding my bike to the um, East Bakersfield branch library. And um, I think I was coping through books. I, my family had moved. I became the new kid in school, the new kid on the block. And books made me feel secure. When I was growing up, we didn't have a bookstore in my town. Um, I didn't spend a lot of time at the library until we moved across town. And I became what most people would consider an obsessive reader. I think it's because books could take me all the places that I was not. I live in North San Diego County and all of my children are grown now, but I take my granddaughter to the Dove Library in Carlsbad um, to encourage her love of the library as well. When I was a little girl, I used to smuggle books into the library. If someone gave me a book as a gift, I didn't always want to read at home where I was the oldest of three sisters and the oldest of all of the cousins. Um, I wanted to have that sense of privacy to read my book. And so I often put my book in my bike, rode my bike to the library, smuggled it inside, and sat in the safety of the library to read my books. In my writing, libraries become my most important tool. I use the libraries for a variety of things as a writer. I just finished my latest novel, and I turned in 32 books to the library. So you can see how important they become to my research. I think the thing that is the most inspiring to me about libraries is that they serve all the people. They serve the rich and the poor. They serve people who have jobs and people who are looking for jobs. They serve the successful and the disenfranchised. Uh, libraries have something for everybody.